I am a male fertility specialist, so I interact with female fertility experts on a routine basis. And it's really with, the, with this team approach where the female side is being looked at, the male side is being looked at, uh, typically during the same period of time to try to optimize fertility potential for both the male and female partner in that particular couple. Now within the male side of things, first there is diagnosis, uh, taking history, knowing what has gone on in that male's lives, what types of things might have affected their fertility potential, be it uh, an inborn error of metabolism, some sort of an abnormal body part, uh, things that, that didn't quite grow uh, completely or in a normal fashion that may limit their fertility options. Even a general urologist, a well-trained general urologist, sometimes they're just not sure and in fact many times Sometimes I will get referrals from other physicians who want uh, a more definitive opinion about is the anatomy abnormal or is it not. Once we know what's going on with the male, then we can have an idea of what options we have in either restoring the proper anatomic features to their body so that sperm can move from the inside to the outside if that is the particular issue or simply bypassing trying to reconstruct and going directly to the testicle and retrieving sperm. Even a handful of sperm can be enough for a couple to be able to have fertilization, embryo formation, and ultimately a pregnancy. What I would tell patients is, if you have seen a urologist and you've been told there's no hope, do not believe that. Please, come to a, a urologist that has done a fellowship that is highly trained in male fertility issues. It's become quite sophisticated, highly, highly specialized, and the typical general urologist oftentimes is not able to stay up with some of these very technical procedures that we're able to do. So it really ha has opened the door to many couples who have been told that that door was not possible to open. Since 1993, when I first started my practice in San Diego, I've conducted over 5,000 microsurgical procedures. Oftentimes, I will be called in by a surgeon, even from another specialty, for my microsurgical expertise so that I can help them to complete something that they need to do. Once you understand microsurgery and the, and the various techniques, you can apply them to many different challenges. What I offer is all possibilities from the male fertility standpoint. Anything that can be done, I do, so that it opens the door for couples.